Hello everyone, I'm Neha Agrawal and this is my first YouTube video. I hope you will enjoy it. The topic for today is decimal. The first question is what are decimal numbers? So a very basic definition of decimal numbers are any number with a dot in it is called as a decimal number. For example, 11.2. This number will definitely be a decimal number. Why? Because there is a dot between this 11 and this 2, 3. Right? Now, another question is why we need the decimal number. So, consider a case when you want a single pen. You want a pen and you went to a shop and shopkeeper has a set of pen that is two pens which cost rupees 25. Right? But as you need only one pen, you will pay only half of this 25, that is 12 rupees and 50 paise, right? To combine this complete 12 rupees and part of another 1 rupees, that is 50 paise, you need the decimal number. That is, you will write this together as 12.50, right? Now, you will observe this carefully. Now, this dot has a right hand side and a left hand side. So, this right hand side, sorry, it was 50 in that case, right? So, this is the right hand side and this is the left hand side. The right hand side represents the part of whole that is 50 pesa out of 100 pesa that is 1 rupees. And the left hand side represents the whole that is whole 12 rupees. And to combine them together we will write it as 12 and the dot and the 50. Now this dot is called as the decimal point decimal point and this left hand side is the whole number part whole number part and this left hand sorry right hand side is called as the decimal part correct that is Decimal part represent the fractional part or the part of a whole. The right hand, uh, left hand side represent the whole number part and the dot in between is called as the decimal point which act as a separator between the whole and the part of a whole. Clear? Now we will see the place value of decimal numbers. We will start with a normal whole number that is 125. In this case, this 5 is at 1's place, this 2 is at 10's place and this 1's is at 100's place. Now, if we observe it carefully, then if we move from left hand side towards right hand side, the place value gets decreases or gets divided by 10. 100 divided by 10 will give me 10, that is it's this place value. Again, this 10 divided by 10 will give me 1 that is this place value, right? Now, decimal numbers follow the same concept. We will extend this 125 to a decimal number. This is a decimal number. This 5 is at 1's place. This is at 10's place and this is at 100's place. Now, decimal number follow the same concepts. That is the place value of the first digit after the decimal that is 2 in this case will have a Place value of 1 by 10 that is this place value divided by 10 and this is called as 10 ten and thn okay and this next number that is 3 in this case will have a place value divided by 10 from this right that is 1 by 10 divided by 10 that is 1 by 100 and it will call at we will call it as 100 THS at the end or I will write it as this is 
khan red ths at the end this is tn en sorry 10 and then that is th okay i hope you are clear with the basic concepts of decimal now in the upcoming videos i will talk about addition subtraction multiplication of decimal till then bye bye